Hello everybody. I just want to say thank you so much for purchasing this course and letting me provide the information for you to make profits in your business. So we're going to transform the way you use Periscope. This is a quick intro video and it does going to go over some of the features that are displayed in this course. So we just want to touch base on the basic use of Periscope. Before you do anything, you have to do these vital steps. Um, I want you to download the app, Periscope app. You can go on your phone, go to the app store and download the app. That's what you have to do first. Next, you will need to sign up to Twitter. I suggest that you do this to double your exposure. One click and you are logged into Periscope when you have a Twitter account. Now you can double up your exposure because anytime you do a scope or a live broadcast, it will automatically feed to Twitter, you just have to hit a button. And you have two platforms displaying your information at all times. So that is the incredible thing. And now they just came out with a new feature that they are also integrated with Facebook. So you can also share it on your Facebook, which is one of the most amazing tools to have three different platforms interconnect without you having to use a whole nother application. Um, but what you want to make sure is you have your handler. A handler is the at sign with the name of your business or who you want to be known for online. So you want to make sure it's consistent with Twitter and it's the same handler so people can follow you and it is a easy way to keep connection and keep your brand going online. So we want to make sure that you always have an app an option just to do Periscope without Twitter. But then down the line, if you do ever want to build Twitter in together, then you're going to have a problem because Twitter will not um, be able to connect you. So you have to start all over on Periscope. So I would advise you just to start connecting with a Twitter account, even if you're never going to use it, but just to have it for an extra display of your information. Okay, so we're going to go into a couple features. I just want you to click the three little peri peeps in the right hand corner to set up your profile. Now this is what your profile will look like when you are finished setting up your slogan or your marketing. I'm going to show you that next. So this is my actual um, information that I have. I go in um, mostly and kind of tweak it a little bit depending on exactly what I'm doing for that holiday or for that year. So, um, or if I'm doing a special, I kind of tweak that. So up on top, you can also put exactly what you do. So you can put your name and you can put um, if you are a coach or something, put that right in the top title. Your handler is going to be in the bottom. The number of hearts you have received will be there and that number does fluctuate. So my number goes up um, as you keep doing scopes. Um, this would be your constraint. And a constraint is something you want to just be known for and kind of keep it simple as possible. So I kind of put in my Facebook group, um, actually the courses I'm doing and my information. And I give away a free um, text um, download that you can have right to your phone. So an elevator script is a constraint for this section and you can do your webinar, you can do a website, you can do all kinds of stuff depending on what you're working on in your business. And also make sure that you're adding emojis, which are those little key little informations that um, let your brain have happy time, right? It's cool. So your stamp on the world. This is exactly how you want to stamp yourself out to the world on Periscope. And following, that's going to be next in line on your Periscope. So you probably, underneath your profile, you probably don't have anybody you're following yet if you just start it. So I do have some rec recommendations in the course of some of the people that you can follow. Um, but depending on what you do or what you want to be have find more knowledge in, you would hit the little magnifier and go and search. So if you're a coach, you would want to... Um, kind of search for coaches if you are a different type of accountant or if you're a 
business owner, you may want to do entrepreneurship. So there's different things you can search for. So you can find people that may be in your field already that you can model to use their um, the way they live broadcast to give you ideas. So this is just networking online. Um, you want to follow people, find connections, and um, try to find some type of consistent information that you find a connection with that you can get on board with them and they can start to follow you also. So next is followers. These are the people that have been on your scopes and have a initial interest in you and your brand. So this is your audience that you have built. And here you also can go into their scopes. You can click their little Perry guy and make sure that you follow them and give them good feedback on their scopes. You can also go back through your replays and actually look at the people that have been giving you love and be really engaged in your um, periscopes and then start to follow them and give them feedback on their scopes. That's really important because it lets you brand grow a lot more because you're interacting with the people that have already been on your scope. So a blocked profile button is the troll storage for haters. Okay. So this is people that pop in and you will get these random, random, awful people that come in and just want to throw you off guard want to say really bad, insulting things to you. And maybe to some of the people that are on there and kind of put you down and you have that in life. And that's anywhere you go. Your choice is to let them go, block them out and move on. You don't want to interact. You don't want to feel like they're against you. It's just what people do and just have to get over it and move on to your scope. So broadcast is exactly what you want to be, um, what you have done, right? Your broadcast is something that you already have and that's where they stored are all stored in this broadcast um, little slot that you can click on to. And you can go back in and watch your replay, see who's engaged, see um, you know how you can make that better, or see that that scope was really good, the title worked, so maybe you wanna you know go a little bit more on that. But always remember that you should always have at least one running scope going. Why? Because that way, if people click on your information, if you're in somebody else's scope, and then they don't see an actual feed for you, they're going to think, well, what's going on? Like, she's not even consistent on here. So you just want to be consistent and at least have one scope, even if it's a three-minute scope, just telling people about your brand. And hey, you never know, you may get business out of that. So you always want to have a consistent um, scope going daily. So really quick, this is start the broadcast. This is what the screen will look like when you're ready to start. All you have to do is put your title in first. That is definitely key 101 because you can't always go back and put a title in and it will just say untitled. Nobody wants to see that, right? So you, when you're ready, you can just hit the start button and boom, you're ready to go. Get out there, just like speaking on stage, you just have to do it. It's public speaking, it's engaging, it's fun, it's creative. It's turning on that spark in your brain. It's letting you share your message to the world. It's letting you find your passion and make a profit off of it from finding key clients. So some of these little tips right now, the arrow button is just your location of where you are. The lock key is in case you wanna do private sessions through Periscope. You can do it with some of your followers and say, hey, these are just for my followers. I'm doing a private coaching session. So if you want to be involved, you have to be following me. And then the other um, little person inside of there is if you want to turn the chat off. That means if you don't want people bringing, asking questions in your chat, you turn it off. And then after your scope, you can say, hey, I'm going to turn this on for Q&A. And then you can click it back on. And the little tweet is means it will go right to your Twitter feed. So you just tweet it out. And that is the simple details that matter and let you deal with your first broadcast. Now, your message to the world. We want to be here to help you share your message to the world. And that is what my course is doing. So I'm so happy that you're here for me. Um, and as you can see onto the side, you can go in and go anywhere around the world. If someone's scoping, you could go into their scope 
if it's an educational scoop or something you want to learn about and give good value. And then you can find actual people will start following you from being on other people's scopes. So it's very, very important. It's engagement, it's value, it's connection, it's networking, and it's about you putting your brand out there and letting people learn more about you on a worldwide level. So you want to take action now and begin your live feed to the world. Have a world's eye view in the palms of your hands. So you can be around the world in Paris and France, you can be in Canada and Hawaii, wherever you want and connect with people. This is one of the highest level of networking and marketing and sales that you can ever imagine. You just have to be creative. You have to get out there and push your passion out to the world and make profits, right? From your replays, from your challenges, from your information that you're giving and learn how to package it and how learn how to engage your followers so you can get more leads and you can get more friends and you can get more education, more awareness, and more value in your business and your brand. So the key for this, if you really want it to work, is to take action and claim your niche in this Periscope. So remember, Periscope is still fairly, fairly new. So consistent action makes life-changing results. And what I want to say is that this is the time to get in. When something's new like this, this is the best time to put your blueprint down, put your actual stamp on who you want to be known for. So you can claim it, own it, and you can take this to the next level, right? You can 5X your business. Say if you're afraid of 10X, then 5X it, right? But this is where it takes people to the next level. I just want to say thank you so much for being a part of my Passions to Profit course. And this is for entrepreneurs and it's going to make you feel better about who you are and know that your message is meant to be out there for everyone to hear. And it's going to get this, your message out there on a different level. So thank you so much. More details are in your Periscope 101. Just click down there and you can get all the feedback and all the one-to-one -one steps that you need to have a successful first scope and many more to come. Thank you.